Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? Thank you for listening and tuning in to another episode of Sarcasm and Orgasm. And if you are new to the channel, make sure you go ahead and you like, comment, and subscribe right down below. Make sure you click that button so you can get your daily dose of all things sarcastic. So before we get into it, let's go. Yes, welcome everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. So, we're gonna do things a little bit differently um, on this one. Um, was kind of thinking, should I make it a podcast? Should I make it a YouTube video? I was just like, ah, fuck it. Let's just go ahead and do it anyway. So let's do it a little different. So I'm gonna say it like this: um, the little things. Yes, the little things. We live in a world now to where we take just the little things for granted, such as little booties, little titties, little midgets, um, a little bit of weed, a little bit of food, in any type of increment. It does not matter. But what it does matter is that we tend to overlook the little things because we are so fixated on getting that big thing. I mean, yes, we live in a world to where we want it now. We want it instant. We want it that hot and ready. You know, we want it in an abundance of time to where we're overstepping just that that little thing, that little that little piece of happiness to get that big happiness. And we shouldn't live like that. Remember, it was not only two years ago that we were all locked in, trying to figure out how we're gonna be able to get back out into the regular world. Yes, you know and I know that stay in the house all day, every day, Mm -mm. That shit was for the birds. We all know that. But the things that we do know is we started to get closer with ourselves and with other people. We started um, coming together and formulating new things and new ideas to where it was almost like we were thankful about what was going on. Um, and I say it like this is like the little things really matter in this world world in this life because we're all on a clock here so we need to just be able to appreciate things whether they're at face value or whether they're not at face value at all i mean it's almost like an idiocracy by saying that but it's <laughs> whatever but um i say that i have been i have done this i have taken little things for granted just to be able to get to the big thing and take it from me that it doesn't always work out that way. Like I said, we are so fixated on trying to get that 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 instant gratification that we're not really to put in the work. We're not re really willing to do what is necessary to build on the little thing to get to the big thing that we are uh, that we have our goal set to. So you need to almost pay attention, a heed to the things that are around you because sometimes you can only, you can always overlook just the most minute. And I mean minute, and that means small for people who don't know what minute means. So the little things matter in this world and it doesn't matter how, mu how little it can be that if you are really willing and really open and honest to you know, just taking a nice, slow, steady approach that the little things will matter. They will matter more than you could ever know. Um, because without those little things, we won't have big things. I mean, come on now. Um, just learn to appreciate things for what they are and how they are. And then you'll have a greater appreciation in life and a much more, more greater appreciation of your own self because you just took the time to be able to just slow down. Just sometimes you need to go at a, a turtle's pace. A lot of people don't want to go at a turtle's pace, but when you do that, you can see the world so much more differently. You really can. You really can. But I just want to say thank you for listening and tuning in. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Also, go over to the podcast on all podcast platforms. 
it doesn't matter where it's at because I am there. Not that I'm trying to be conceited or anything, but I try to get myself out there as much as possible so you can listen. So go check out the podcast, Sarcasm and Orgasm. Go check out the latest episode that I got, SSL. And before you check out SSL, make sure you check out BBL because they are almost tied into each other. They really are. And no, it is not the BBL that you're thinking of. Trust me. You are going to want to listen to that. So this has been Mr. Sarcasm himself, Will Day Fresh. And this has been another episode of Sarcasm Orgasm. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you go comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. And as always, I will all talk to y'all soon.